not supposed to be going to work so early. I know, I say good morning a few, an hour ago when I woke up and it was doing by less than an hour when I was having my lunch ready for today. So what happened is like when I arrived yesterday to work, um, somebody told me that uh, one of the girls that worked with me uh, it was feeling really bad, like headache and all that kind of things, and then her face began to get numb, and uh, I don't know, a lot of things that, to be honest, I really fast associate with what happened with my father, and he died uh, a year ago with a truck, and um, then they told me that and the other girl took her to the hospital because she, she began to get worse, you know. So, um, uh, it was kind of shock for me, but in the same time, it was like, um, she will be okay, okay. Well, thanks God, she's okay. She is at home. She will have to take two days off uh, to get better. That means also that I will have to <laughs> cover her shift. I'm lucky like that, <laughs> but it's okay. I'm happy that she's okay. So today I'm coming to open. Last night I wasn't closer. So uh, to be honest, I am a little tired because you know, you arrive from work and it's not like, oh, you arrive and you go to bed. No, I take a shower, I, I have my dinner and uh, you're still like a little too awake to go to bed after be working. So, I went to bed almost 11, between reading my book and everything, and uh, I woke up today at 5, um, but I still feel tired. It's like all this week, that had, it's almost two weeks now, that I'm, I'm exhausted. My weekend, I don't know, I... I didn't have the, the recovery or the healing that I was needing. So I have practically five more days and I I have vacation, a week of vacation. I think that will be my time to recover. So I have to open tomorrow and I will have to open today and tomorrow. So that's okay. At least I will have the afternoon and maybe take a nap to feel better. scan virus, like part of my week um, computer maintenance. I will go to put some stuff in the basement. Of course, not the dogs, the stuff that I have here. <laughs> These babies. So I have here my um, chamomiles. These ones are some of the flowers. Look at that. And here, these ones are the borders flowers, and these ones are more flowers. I need to put a little more water now. Okay, this is almost over. I will go to take a shower and then take a breakfast. Today I'm working 9 to 10, tomorrow 9 to 6, if we don't have any other change. And then vacation. I have to clean all these. I just took my shower. But my energy level is really low. <laughs> so I better do breakfast. Maybe that will put me a little more up. So I will have a daybreak coffee. I put a little of cream there. Believe it or not. <laughs> I know, I don't drink too much coffee. But you know when you feel that you're like needing something like that like it's a little of comfort you know and all that I'm thinking is a coffee with a little of cream and maybe bread to dip a little inside no, this is not my cookies this is my baby's cookies <laughs> why do you think that she's around here 
So I have this right here. And this one is so good. Cool. And it's looking so good now. Have a little helper here, like always. No, stay there, don't touch. Yeah, you know. And I'm taking off everything that is in the dishwasher. Heidi, don't touch, it's clean. I don't need more help for that. And then I will put everything that is extra. This was an extra, well, not extra. I got this one with the flowers that my husband bought. I will bring to work, maybe somebody wants. I have a lot of <laughs> um, so many flower bases so I will bring with me trying to sneak and leak what I am trying to put in them yeah I catch you <laughs> you know that okay I'll put more of these on here I know that I have a helper trying to leak everything that I put here Heidi, you don't need to lick everything that I put there. <laughs> Creature. And I have my floors like a big mess again, but it's okay. <clears throat> Two more days of work, right? And he's trying to calm the sun out a little. If you notice, it's like... It's it's only a few seconds and then again, rain, <laughs> wind, look at that, it's kind of weird, weird weather. Okay, so I will try to explain why I'm so exhausted. Um, I finished uploading my video a little late, like almost, how many days? I made that video Friday and yesterday and last night Tuesday. Oh, I'm lost in the days. Yeah, it's, it was a Friday video. So it's five days um, that took me to upload one video. What happened is like after we went to have lunch and everything I was feeling so exhausted. I didn't know how to explain. Um, everything was okay, I was having fun, I was enjoying everything, you know, and um, suddenly it was like uh, when I got the message that somebody got sick and uh, a lot of things that were going at work and I was like, why did I read the message? I shouldn't have read the message. And um, I began to feel like a stress and I told my husband, I, I don't feel good, I feel really bad, tired, and in pain, and everything, but I think it's all stress, and um, I came home, I changed my clothes and everything, then I relaxed a little, and I began to feel better, so the next day I have to go and work in the night, practically the closing shift, that is until, you know, you close the store, until you close the store, <coughs> sorry, and because I got people sick, I have to go the next day at 6 in the morning, so that means usually I wake up two hours before that because I try to do my workouts and also when I don't do my workouts it's like I do my stuff, I try to leave things done before I leave, <clears throat> no matter that sometimes I'm doing extra the night before. So there it was like a short time of sleep, then I came back and I have to it was like I was feeling tired, but in the same time I was not able to take a nap. So I keep going and going. The next day I have to go and open again, but I didn't sleep at all. It was like I don't know if it if happened to you that you are sleeping and you are thinking in so many things that it, that are you need to do to have ready because you are short of people and everything at work. And um, I was waking up like every hour, and my husband say that he. He didn't sleep good because I woke up him every time that I was standing up from bed and everything. So the next thing that was, well, it was in that way, I will say, all the days, you know, closing, open, closing, open. And then yesterday, I worked it also 6 to 3. 
yeah, 63. And then I came home and I was like, okay, I couldn't sleep last night very good, so I will stay awake, no matter that I'm exhausted. And uh, in that way I will sleep all the night. So I was watching some of the videos and my eyes were closing and closing, so I said to my husband, I, I think I will have to take this nap. And I took a nap of almost two hours. <laughs> I woke up and my husband had dinner ready for me, waiting and saying, are you feeling better? So he gave me a very healthy meal. We watched The Boys and then we went to bed. Um, actually, I slept all night, just all night. I don't remember having dreams or nothing. I think I was really exhausted. Right now, it's like... Not feeling tired, but in the same time, it's like, I'm so tired. You know what I mean? It's like so many days of these crazy schedules and everything. It's like my body is no want to keep going. And um, and I try to find the energy to keep going of whatever is around me. Like right now, it's a little sun. So I'm trying to motivate myself to do things. But in the same time, I'm thinking, God, I have to work from 1 to 10 today. And then tomorrow you have to go at 8. So I better will slow down and uh, not try to do a lot. And that is what I will do. I don't want to clean, I don't want to do anything. Maybe I will just sit and watch uh, videos and try to relax. Two more days, two more days and vacations. That is good. Lunch together. So I have brown rice that will be part of my lunch. I'll put like a bit of rice. Uh, and now I put um, like a little part of the rotisserie chicken that we had last night. I cut in pieces and I put over the rice. Like you know, I don't like to bring knife with me <laughs> so I have everything cut already and now I will put some of the Brussels sprout but also I will cut in half so I don't have to put all together there and not have to cut this part of my lunch is ready I just cover it's a healthy meal and now I will do like a little dressing for my Brussels sprout dressing is ready for today Now I can go and finish videos, I mean, to relax a little. I still having like two hours. For my lunch box, I'm, I put here uh, the mix of um, the ulam and the... Sorry, where are you? Uh, Maharajachai ulam, ulam, I cannot say the name, and samurai chai chai mate type of fall so that is what I have here and I will bring with me it is a 45 I I didn't sleep I mean <laughs> I didn't sleep more than I need I ah, okay I slept until 6 45 I woke up and I took the day um, easy. That is what I'm saying. It's my last day of work before my one week of vacation. And, um, oh God, I just straightened my hair, but I think I got. So, for my last day of work before my week of vacation, I decided to take it so easy at the point that, um, I took my breakfast and I didn't make any meal or nothing for today. I will go and relax in a Starbucks, sit there, and that way I will not kill and get people also going to the break room in my lunch time and asking me for questions or to please go and translate something. Can you believe? It's like frustrating. It's like you're having your lunch time, it's supposed that you are out of work and people are still going and trying to make you do things. So, I will go to a Starbucks that is like up 
block and a half from when I work and just relax there, read my book. It's all that I bring. My book and a, a big sweater in case that gets colder. And so that is what is going on for now. Well, I didn't bring lunch and I decided to go for Burger King. I cannot drink all that. Look at this day, it's so ugly. <sighs> lunch time. I will be back in few at work and then four more hours and going home for vacation. Morning. Just Pilates today. Let's do it. Pilates is over. And now I have my machine on. Time to do at least 30 minutes of elliptical. The best way to do these workouts with videos that you can watch. So that is what I will be doing. 30 minutes is enough for today. After two weeks not doing anything, the workouts and this elliptical will be enough. On my breakfast, and if you can see, my husband made a stir, stir fry yesterday, and he has to use all this. And already the kitchen is looking like a big mess. It was neglected for a few days, if you can see. Well, we tried to keep clean, but floors and everything, dogs coming out inside. My bad schedule, so now it's a big mess, and I will have to clean after my breakfast. So I'm boiling an egg. Um, I will have oranges. I will make a, a oatmeal and some strawberries. And I'm not looking off. My husband and me looks like we don't like the maple nut, and it's always the one that we left <laughs> from all the package. So <sighs> you have to have this one. I will go and buy just one flavor, and no more mixed flavors. I have like six of these. And he doesn't want to eat, I don't want to eat. So, breakfast for today is oatmeal, maple oatmeal, <laughs> with a lot of strawberries. They were getting bad, so I took the ones that are good and I have a lot of strawberry. I didn't get shy on strawberry. I have a boiled egg. I don't get a hard boiled egg. I like very, very mushy. It's my way to have all the proteins and everything. Um, and I have an orange juice. So this is my breakfast. I'll have my uh, dishwasher running. I have to wash all these. I'm drinking uh, uh, green tea. This one is the Ulam and I don't remember the name right now. I always forget the name of this one. Let me see. It's the Maharaja Chai Ulam. And I have to wash this. I was cleaning part of the kitchen. I have to clean that. Okay. All this wash. And doggies inside. I kind of clean a little the floors. Just a little. I don't want to do too much today. My first day off. No, no jumping. No jumping. Go get your toy. Where is the ball? So in the company of my two babies, I think I will put a movie. <laughs> What do you have? Yeah, I will watch a movie right now. I'm not watching a movie. I'm watching Food Network. It's still being really nice to watch. Right? Right. The food I changed to House Hunters International is so amazing. So many houses that are so cute. Lunch, I will have part of the leftover of, um, rice. We'll put a little of the soy sauce in the top. Just a little. This too. Then I will have. And also, once inside the meat, is going for the salmon uh, fuki, furikake or the katsukafumi furikake. That is like a sasoni, a season, seasoning for rice. This one has a salm, salmon uh, flavor. And this one has like the uh, fishy flavor, um, the katsu fumi 
or whatever is the name, it's like um, some kind of algae or something like that. <laughs> it's hard to explain. I don't know how to explain, but the flavor is pretty fishy, and I love the flavor, to be honest. My husband hates these kind of seasonings, but I am always for this kind. So I will go for this one. Okay, I have the seasonings for the rice there, and I will put just a little of the stir fry that my husband need, made yesterday. It's a pork stir fry, and that would be all my lunch. I will put this in the microwave. Mmm, it smells so good. I just finished, I just finished the addition of the uh, haul that I made with products that I got from Amazon. But now I want to go and do bread. My husband bought more bread. Uh, flour and the stuff that I need. Okay, I hope my bread is going good because I don't know if I did it in the right way. In 3 hours and 11 minutes I will know. <laughs> it's hard to see right now. Oh, it looks really good. Do you want it? Well, it's not moving anymore so I guess it's heating now. <laughs> you want to eat a chili flakes? Um, just a little. Okay. Thank you. I don't recently think that my bread didn't came in the right way. <laughs> it said keep warm. It didn't raise too much. I'm not sure what we would eat wrong, but we would taste in few. Working in another apron that is to say goodbye to one of my co-workers and uh, I have to make this like in last moment because Cynthia was in charge of this and she didn't have time so now I'm doing really really simple and I hope she likes she loves a lot of this entangle and she loves everything about like spring things spring colors so I hope she likes that and now I better go to check my bread I don't know I'm watching some splinter series slip chat with three of the girls that always are reading books and everything and it's kind of fun so I will keep doing this and then I will go to relax or oh, I have to go and do groceries so I'm planning to have my tea I was washing my cup and I see see that strong light there it's from my neighbor usually it's like a motion light and I'm surprised that it turned on because everything else is dark. Okay, it went out and he's almost dead. I hope there were not my dogs when they were going to the back side, but that light is really high. Anyway, the dogs didn't back yet. I will do a little tea and I think I will be going to bed after this. Oh uh, yeah, it was a long day. Maybe I didn't have too many things in the videos, but it was a long day. <laughs> so water ready and this is a good night. So I will see you tomorrow. Have a good weekend everybody.